um, right before break in December, the uh, Sandy Hook Elementary School shootings occurred. And um, in talking about it with the yearbook class, we decided that the best way to honor the, the deaths of the students and teachers at that school would be to do 26 acts of kindness, uh, one for each person that lost their life at the school shooting. Um, the 26 uh, acts of kindness uh, was on um, you know, the Today Show, uh, Katie Couric and uh, Ann Curry and various people were talking about um, that's what people were doing in order to show their support and to, to try and make the world a better place by um, you know, showing that there's some kindness and humanity and that uh, people are capable of, of not just cruelty but also kindness and compassion. It's, it's always interesting that uh, oftentimes the nice things that we say to somebody or the nice things that we do for somebody, we don't even realize the effect that they have. Um, and you, you never know if somebody's having a bad day and you, and you help them take their bags to the car or you help them um, buy them lunch or get, grab them a coffee to give them extra energy for the day. I think a lot of times people do those random acts of kindness and don't have any idea the impact that they have on people's lives. But, um, you know, sometimes just a kind word or a small gesture really can make a big difference in somebody. It can prevent someone from committing suicide. It can prevent somebody from, from hurting somebody else. It can prevent somebody from taking out their anger on another person. So it, it can often be a domino effect. And more often than not, we don't realize the effect of our words on people. And so the 26 acts of kindness kind of takes us and, and makes us more conscious and more aware of, of the good things that we can do and how our kindness and our, our thoughtfulness can affect others in a, in a positive way.